today, I really just wanted to do something to make myself feel good. You know what I'm saying? I asked on my Facebook what you guys wanted to see and someone suggested actually that I refresh my ends here. And I've been thinking about what to do with my hair because seven months ago, I dyed my hair a semi-permanent navy blue color. <laughs> And this is the result of seven months of not touching it. I think we can all agree that the term semi-permanent is absolute bullshit. This is here forever. So I was looking on YouTube for some ideas about what to do to the ends of my hair. And I came across like an entire genre of videos of people just getting blue dye out of their hair, which is apparently a thing. And I came across this channel called Offbeat Look. And three years ago, she posted a video about how if you crush up by vitamin C tablets and mix it with shampoo and do that a couple times and like massage it and apparently get some of the blue out without having to rebleach it because I know you guys want me to do insane things to my hair but I've been growing it out and it's so healthy and so nice and I'm really enjoying it so I'm trying to just do this thing where I let it grow out like any rational hairdresser I imagine would be like chop this shit off and just start over it's like having somebody on your softball team that's not very good but they're good for team morale let's not cut them let's keep them so it's like pretty healthy but I don't want to bleach it again and I don't want to cut it I just want to like make it fun and fresh for summer you know because it's it's very pretty I like it I don't hate it but I would like it to be like a little fresher so I want to delve into a territory that I've never been one I want to try that vitamin C treatment that she suggested we crush these up we mix it with shampoo we massage it and then we see what happens then my plan a is to I've never used a toner in my life. I am so excited at the idea that if I got some of this blue out, I could maybe tone it into a color that was like a silvery ash. I think that's very ambitious. I think it would be like a green gray ash if we're being real. And then my plan B is to just throw some purple on there, which I read this bottle and apparently- Mom, You coming for my brand? I dyed that hair. I did that hair. My brand? No. I was reading this bottle and this apparently glows under black light. I don't have a black light to test Wait, that. Wait, what? I think it would be cute though if our hair matched each other. This isn't what I dyed your hair with, but I mean, it's similar to what it looks like now. Right, if we had matching hair. If you're expecting to look this good, expect disappointment. So yeah, I'm, I'm going to try and lift the blue, see what happens, don't have high hopes for it. I think bleach is really the only thing to get rid of this. And then we'll try and tone it. And then if I hate it, we'll dye it purple. So basically my hair is gonna go through a lot today. Take a moment of silence for the torture I'm about to put my hair through. Dear hair, I'm so sorry. Love, Jenna Beach. The good thing about vitamin C is that unlike bleach, like it might dry my hair out a lot, which is okay, but it's not gonna damage it. Let's get started, oh, Beach. Seemed like enough. I'm just gonna wrap it in this and just... It needs to be like a powder. This poor table, man. We just got it and I'm already abusing it. Should I just bleach it? I feel like this is gonna take forever. <laughs> oh, we're getting somewhere. Oh, it's already getting out. You're hammering it. Careful of what? Your hand. Whatever. Hey, Jenna, what are you doing? My hair, beach. So apparently if you're gonna do it this method, just make sure you wrap it in like 70,000 plastic bags. Ooh. Okay, there's definitely still some like tablets in there, but we'll just we'll see what happens. Ooh. So then she says, take some cheap shampoo. So I got this family size bottle of Swab for $2.99 beach. Put it in here. And girl, you gonna make yourself a beautiful paste. Oh, should be very, very safe from the common cold. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Hers was like a lot thicker. I fucked up somehow already. Whoops. And then we're gonna leave this on for a little while. Like how long? Like 30 minutes. Damn. Bloop. Oh, you just dip it in? Yeah, beach. Hi, welcome to my salon. First, just dip your hair in this shit. <gasps> Wait a second. Holy shit. No. Look at the ends. Maybe it's just because they're covered in white pills, but like that looks like it's lifting on the ends already. Like she did this treatment like a couple times in a row, you know, and like let it sit. So I don't even know. I just think it would be really cool if I could get some of this out. I could tone it into like a silvery color. So I think that'd look pretty. Look at it. It's coming out of the ends. It really is. Can you really tell? Yeah. Is this gonna like lighten my brown hair? Very professional way to do this. 
This part's all blue? Nah, you got it pretty much now. Hmm. How do you feel? Do you feel beautiful? I feel disgusting, but I am interested to see if this works at all. I just can't believe that I dyed my hair in navy blue seven months ago, and it's still in here. Some people do something called a bleach wash, where they bath. like bath. Bleach, bleach bath. bath, where they mix like bleach with shampoo or conditioner or something. But they're like, how to lift color out of your hair without bleach. Okay, mix bleach <laughs> and shampoo. Yeah, I'm like, but that's bleach. I like this experience. All right, so I think that I'm just gonna like massage this and leave this in for 30 minutes and then we'll wash it and see how the first round went and if we wanna do another round. I got it on my pants, I got it on my pants. I smell like beef, I smell like beef. What a DIY hack. Yeah, what if all your hair just fell out? No, it's been about 30 minutes. I've been rubbing it. I can't really tell, there's just so much white stuff in here. I'm gonna rinse it and see what it looks like and then we'll decide how to proceed. It doesn't really look like it did a whole lot. My hair down here feels outrageously dry. So dry and bad, like just real bad. And I really don't think it did like a whole ton. But to be fair, this girl and a lot of other people that have used this say like you should do it more than once. So what do you say we double down and do it again? So we'll do it again just to say we gave it a fair shot. Like you can't blame me for trying. I see somebody that's like crush up some vitamin C pills and it'll get the blue out of your hair. Like I'm here to try it. I'm here for that. But you know? if, if you finish the second treatment and it looks like even remote similar to before you started this is bullshit this whole thing is bullshit and you need to acknowledge that Yes. Yeah, but if I bleached it, they'll probably just fall off. I just, I didn't want to throw purple on here and then have it come out like the worst color you've ever seen, you know? I'm pretty sure you're going to be putting purple on there. You're anticipating my failure? Is yes. that what you're saying? Yes, I am. Because I'm watching it. Damn it! I'm, watch, I'm literally watching the progression of nothing right in front of my ass. Stop! Look, I think the lesson that I've learned over the last seven months is that if you dye your hair navy blue, it's just never coming out. Like, did you notice any difference, even in the slightest? Nope. Fuck. Don't squint at me, okay? It's helping a little bit. Squints more. Stop! It's been about 30 minutes again. I can tell that my hair is just so dry. Maybe better than bleach, but like, it's real bad, fam. You know what I'm saying? Feels like I might as well have bleached it. The texture is disgusting. I see no difference. Fuck. What did I just do all that for? Oh! If I tone it and it comes out butt, is that gonna be even worse to put the purple on top of butt? Probably. So what do you think I should do? I think you just go purple. No. Let's try the toner. I've never used a toner. It's like a whole different world. I'm ready. One part. One part. A little more. Two parts. That was very scientific. I don't know how to do this. You just slap it on here. Oh, should I wear gloves? It's too late now. Just forget it. What am I doing? <laughs> what even is toner even? Uh, this honestly might be like my worst hair video of like what not to do ever. It's so wet. Why is it so wet? I don't get it. I can already tell that this isn't doing anything at all, which means like if you have blue green stuck in your hair, <laughs> Your choice is to bleach it or dye it something else or cut it off because none of this is working. Did I use enough of this? I don't know how this works. You use plenty. There's not a lot of hair that you're It's like a bottle of cologne. Like, what is it? Google timer, six years. Should we just set a timer for six years? Timer, 84 years. Julian! It's been 30 minutes and I can tell nothing is gonna happen. Look, it's exactly the same. I've never spent this much time doing absolutely nothing to my hair. It's like when you like do a braid for like an hour and then you decide you hate it at the end. It's like that times 10. I'm gonna rinse this out. It's time to execute plan B. And I hope that all of plan A didn't ruin plan B, but what are we gonna throw that purple in here? Bring I need a purple. fresh summer look and I'm not gonna let this bullshit get in my way. You're a strong independent woman. That's and don't right. Need, don't need no vitamin C. I don't need no vitamin C. Ever. Did I just start the video or have I been making it for hours? Look, I washed the toner out. Isn't it a shocking transformation? I feel shocked. Ooh! Look at that did nothing. How sad. I feel sad. Aren't you glad that I had a plan B? Rule number one of being a Virgo is you always prepare for worst case scenario all the time. Oh, it says shampoo hair then dry hair. I gotta go dry my hair. How's your day?
Stop it. Truly, it feels worse than the time that I permed it. Is it really? Yeah. You want to feel it? Oh my God. This is the way you do hair, right? You separate separate it into two large sections and just do it. I swear to God, if this purple doesn't go in my hair, I'm going to lose it. Ooh. This doesn't look like it's dyeing my hair at all. What even is this? What did I buy? Did I done fucked up? It looks like it's just turning it blue again. It's turning blue. Oh my God. It's literally just darker blue. Wait, bitch, what? I have some purple, do you want that? Honestly, yeah. But you have extra purple? Well, a little bit, it's mixed with conditioner. Is it cause I just toned it and it's not like sinking in? Are they gonna use me as like a tutorial in beauty school where they're like, this is what happens when you use a toner before a color. They might. Oh no! But then at least you will have helped someone in the making of this. Beach, no! I thought I was buying purple dye. It's <laughs> straight up blue. Stop! Oh, oh, just squirt some in there. All right, Julian lent me some of his dye mixed with conditioner so we can try to make this work. At least there's like dye in here. Oh, it's so dark. Oh God, what did I do? Oh, that's better, right? That's gonna be purple. Oh, but there's like so much stuff. It's like not evenly coating it. Oh, beach, it's a disaster, beach. Does it look cute? Yeah. How did I fuck up this bad? I'd be really out here doing dumb shit, huh? No, it's okay. it's finally caught up to me. All of my dumb decisions, I'm paying for them. No, it's okay. I can't get any color to saturate this strand. Why would I lighten it to do this? So dumb. It's been a minute though since my hair's been purple. It's very exciting. Yeah. Look at it, there's like spots in here that are just still blue. Oh, it's gonna look weird and janky. I'm hiding your hair. Oh, it looks like shit. Something tells me my technique really isn't gonna pay off this time. Is this starting to look better or worse? Bad. Really? I guess just like the vitamin C, I'm gonna sit here and try and rub this into these blonde bits. Hopefully come out with some sort of result that makes any sense whatsoever. But I'm hoping I can pull out a win. All right, well, I'll see you back in like 30 minutes and then the time it takes to wash it out and dry it. We'll see what I done did. Oh my God. I think it looks so nice. You better boy, because this is all I got. I like, I love it. I think that it looks so much better than the super faded blue green, even though that was nice, like to a point. There's definitely some parts in here that my strategy of just creating two parts and glopping some hair dye on has done me dirty, but you know what? I think it's dimensional. It's hair couture, it's one of a kind. Couldn't be created even if you tried beach. I like this color because I know what this fades to. Although I promise you, even if this washes out, you will still see that blue green underneath here. It's gonna hang on until forever beach. But I think it's really nice for summer to have like a nice updated color on the bottom, which allows me to healthily grow out the rest of my hair. Yes, it looks like I did it myself, but you know what? I'm free, bitch. We don't have a black light, but I am curious if it would glow under a black light at all. I do love purple though. I think it's a very flattering color on literally almost everyone. And it's so. gonna fade nicely. You have pulled it out. So the salon have... always pulls it out. Not always. No, the absolutely. salon always pulls yeah, it the out. The salon has maybe a 30% success rate of pulling it out. This is definitely a tutorial of what not to do when you could very simply just put some purple on your ends. And I still managed to fuck that up. And the whole entire beginning of this video is like stuff that just doesn't need to happen. Wow, now we match. Are you jealous, Beach? I'm coming for you. Well, it was almost a fail and I was really worried. And I was also worried that between the toner and the color, like my hair was gonna start falling off. Let me see. Yeah, it's strong too. Fuck is Please don't leave me any comments about everything I did wrong. I already know. And it's not like I'm gonna learn my lesson. But I hope you guys liked watching me do this. And I honestly was incredibly curious if that vitamin C thing worked on blue dye. And, and now you know it doesn't work at all. It, a <laughs> it worked a little, I wanna say that it actually worked a little bit, but like at what expense? I should have just thrown purple in there, but I was worried that if I just put the purple on over the blue, it was gonna be muddy and brown. So I did a good job and you know it, pay me. <laughs> Not paying you shit. Pay me. Congrats on your hair. I'm like a brunette bird of paradise. A brunette bird of paradise. Brunette of paradise. <laughs> Goodbye. Subscribe!